Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to draw a Tyrannosaurus Rex. So bring a paper, pencil, eraser, whatever. We're going to have fun. So I am going to open up my Procreate app on my iPad. Um, have you seen my, my stories? Yeah, I, I do all my drawings using this app and using an iPad and my Apple Pencil. Works really well. And I'm going to just paste an image of a T-Rex. Here we go. There. Doesn't that look good? I found him on the internet. I know, there's so many dinosaurs on the internet. But you can also find them in books. Um, um, yeah, I always find it helpful to look at something when I'm drawing so I could get the shapes. And I'll show you what I mean because I'm just going to draw over this T-Rex. Here's a nice red. Good. So that should stand out. And okay, looking at his head, hmm, that's like a good trapezoid shape. You know, trapezoids, they're like one side is bigger, like his mouth part is longer. Good straight lines. Um, and then his neck here is kind of another two straight lines, like a like another rectangle. The body, uh, like a half circle. I I don't know, like egg shape. I don't know what that is. Um, but you see it? Tails. Yeah, it's a triangle. And his legs here. There's a lot of kind of trapezoid like shapes on his legs. You see that? Like one, two, three, there's his toes and his back legs, maybe just and then his nutter, more like a triangle toes at the end, and his tiny little arms, I love their arms, <laughs> so small, um, what is that? It's like, yeah, two little shapes I, I just little little claws at the end, okay, and then his mouth is like a big triangle right there we go you see that the eyes are here all right let's uh let's turn off the image and let's see what we got okay that's that's a good shape let's we can work with this um i mean this is just more like a sketch but we'll lower the opacity and draw on top of this okay okay so this i'm gonna try to simplify things here a bit um like this body let's combine it with the neck you know you can make it a little bit bigger so it kind of runs into the neck uh and yeah let's just keep drawing through it so that we'll have things overlap but we'll erase them bigger and the head i think let's make it bigger yeah like he's really roaring right yeah, i mean and i so then he needs a bigger mouth so let's draw a bigger triangle yeah like that's a proper t-rex good okay uh, this his arms let's make little little let's make it into one let's simplify it into like one like half banana shape with these claws at the end these killer claws yeah tail okay let's just extend the bottom keep it and then kind of so the lines are more kind of smooth the body just kind of runs into the t moves onto the tail see that and then for his legs i think i'm gonna just do the same thing i did with the arms just kind of like these simplify it into just one little giant half banana shape yeah with killer toes um not our Kind of half banana shape. But, but he's walking here, so let's make the toes go down. Yeah. So he's moving. He's on the move. Okay. Looking good. All right. So now let's move the eyes here. And give him some eyebrows. Yeah, we should make him look angry. Yeah. Yeah, he's angry. No, maybe more angry. Yeah. Because... T-Rexes are, they're just always angry, right? They're looking for food and they need teeth. Big teeth. Because 
They like eating meat. Yeah, good. All right. That looks good. I'm just gonna erase some lines uh, that we don't need. Like we don't need this one. Good. And we don't need this one either. So let's erase that. Um, where else does it overlap there? Yeah, I like to just draw through and have things overlap and then erase afterwards. That way the lines kind of like move, you know, like visually it's just moving even though. Yeah, okay, let's turn off the back layer and there we go. That's a nice T-Rex. I like this. Give him some nostrils so he can sniff out his food. Good. Okay. We'll have another layer below the line layer. Now this will be our, our coloring layer where we color everything in. What color should he be? Red. I want to be red. Red, 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 red. Oh, okay. Sure. Why not? Red it is. The T-Rex has spoken. So, yeah, I like to just listen to my drawings when I draw. Mm. I like coloring in with big brushes. Just, just fill it all in. Color, 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 color. I, you know, I'm not worried about going over the lines because I have a pretty good eraser. So let's just color that all in. Color, color the tail. There we go. And then now let me get an eraser. And we'll just erase all these lines. Clean it up. Okay, erase, erase, erase. Okay. Yeah, clean that up. I want to see those teeth. See those big white teeth. <laughs> oh, oh, forgot the arms. <laughs> Oops. Yeah, color that part in. Okay, did I did I miss anything? Oh, I need see some white eyes. Yeah, there he goes. Make his eyes pop. Okay, I'm just gonna let's give him a little shade. I'm just locking the the color layer. That means, you know, I I could only draw where I've already drawn. So I'm not gonna. Uh, it's also called an alpha lock. Let's just shade him in with some darker colors here, just just to give him uh, more of a 3D look. Yeah, just just along the edges, maybe in the bottom. Yeah, his arms, his his legs. Nice. How about how about some highlights? Some give him some little lighter areas. Okay, some where the sun is shining on his his head, his back. Maybe his tail, yeah. Nice. All right. Here's our red Tyrannosaurus Rex. Looks pretty good, I think. Okay. So, um, rawr. Hey, so I hope that was fun and helpful for you. I know it was fun for me. Be sure to subscribe so you can get more stories and bit drawing stuff like this from me. I am E.B. Adams, children's author and illustrator on YouTube. Thanks for watching.